these employees in the years uh, prior to when we started our clinic in September of 2015 would, most of them did not have primary care physicians, most of them would utilize the emergency room at high cost to, uh, for their health care. And so uh, the family who uh, owns the uh, packing plant wanted to put a physician in, in, in on the grounds uh, in one of the uh, plants and have their patients and their employees and family members care for. September 1st of 2015, we started doing that, and uh, uh, we're having a great response. We have an in-house pharmacy, full-time pharmacist. All their medications are free. All their care is free. The Matheson family said, we're, this is the third generation for them for running this company, and they have third and fourth generations of people that are on the line packing these fruit, and they want to continue that relationship, so, and in a healthier way. So, a lot of the diabetics were not, didn't have glucose, glucometers in the, uh, at home. We have them with a free glucometer, go all their testing strips, checking their sugars, seeing remarkable response rates and, and because they're being cared for. So routine laboratories that are appropriate, you know, mammography, those, those sort of things, colonoscopies at their age, when age appropriate. But all those things, and, and again, just getting the, the clientele and the population to figure out, hey, this is free. Yes, you can come here and get all your chronic medications for free. has really been, been, been a, a life-changing circumstance for a lot of them. Well, there's been, a, been several cases of that. Um, number one, um, a, a female a woman came in and said, thank you for treating my husband. I saw him earlier in the fall, 55-year-old male, asymptomatic, filled those medications for his high blood pressure, his high cholesterol, and checked a prostate-specific antigen because he uh, was over 50 years of age. And he had an elevated prostate-specific antigen, went to the urologist and was found to have prostate cancer. It was caught very early, and he's cured. So and she, was, she was very, very appreciative. But there's cases of that. And, and again, just engaging this population, you know, telling them we're checking in them for diabetes and how to try to work with their diets and try to, try to help them to you know, tr get some weight off and that sort of thing. I think this is going to be ground changing for the, the whole uh, valley. This is, we're not the only packing, uh, fruit packing company in the, in the valley. The second largest employee, the hospital being the first, uh, uh, the um, Confluence Health being the largest employer. But I think other companies are going to have to say, wow, we need, this is working for them so well, we need to, to try to work through that and try to um, you know, implement the same sort of healthcare options that Stemelt has done.